Sarasota's Circus Ring of Fame welcomes a new class of inductees, among them one of the first female graduates of Clown College. <laughs> this 10 Tampa Bay's Adoria Chumba shows you organizers have added a new upgrade, too. They've graced the circus rings for many years, and now they're being immortalized in the Circus Ring of Fame. And looking back on it, it was one of the greatest honors of my life because the year before I went to Clown College, there were no girls in the class. So I was there the first year they had females, and I had no idea what was expected. The Ring of Fame was set up in 1988 in Sarasota St. Armand's Circle. It celebrates more than 150 of the world's top achievers in circus arts and culture. The new group includes Peggy Williams, the first female to graduate from the Clown College. It makes me happy to see so many female clowns who are making not only livings out of clowning, but businesses too, supporting the clowning arts like costume makers. And High Stallion performer Janet Williams, as well as Reverend Father Jerry Hogan, known as a circus chaplain. A Generation Next award is going to Daredevil Annalise Knock. I think the most important part is mentally preparing and just making sure that you have your head on straight for every performance and not taking it for granted. She's the youngest daughter of circus superstar Bello Knock. The great one. Almost always how I've seen people get hurt is the minute they get a little bit too comfortable, a little bit too cocky, a little bit too passive about what you're doing. So that was probably the most important thing that my father instilled in me. The plaques now have QR codes, which people can scan to view biographies and performances of the honorees. When COVID happened, and everybody started using QR codes for menus, if you all remember, okay? We looked at that and we said, that's the answer. And all these biographies can be shared anywhere on this planet. In Sarasota, Adoria Chumba, 10 Tampa Bay. So several of the inductees are scheduled to appear at the induction ceremony. That's happening tomorrow at 4.30 in the afternoon. It'll be in the Circus Sarasota tent at the Nathan Benderson Park.